Hello everyone, this is Fearful Yoshi, and we're back with more Dragon Quest VIII. In the last episode, we talked to this chief about Impera, and apparently we just need to follow this, this shadow? Impera's shadow into the dark world in order to chase after Raptor or something? I don't remember. Let's talk to him, to, to him again. The strong only fight is not the... Is the plot telling us we need to head over to the dark world now? That's what it sort of sounds like. Wait a minute, have we talked to you? I don't remember. You're closed. You must be very tired. Actually, yeah, we do. We haven't. We didn't rest. Last time I was here. And no Medea cutscene. Oh well. That's unfortunate. Okay, so. Go. Go, Char. Or is it good morning, as you say, outside the island? How did you... Oh, you did say there were a few refugee, refugees from outside of the town. But anyway, uh... <laughs> I don't really know where to go from here, guys. I mean... They didn't really tell a specific place where the shadow's going to be, right? So we, do we just need to... Do we just need to go and find it by ourselves? Well, this is going to give us a town map. So let's try leaving and... See what we can find. Miso uh, Sufin. And... Huh. Alright, we already talked to that guy. Um, well, dang. Ha. <laughs> so, I... Sorry if I'm so quiet, it's just, uh... Um, I just kinda spooed up the game again, ready to record, and I just rea realized, well, dang, I have no idea where to go. Zoom out. Uh, that's not helping us either. Whoops. I guess let's just keep walking around and exploring, I guess. Um, yeah, just explore the island. Oh, what do we have here? Okay, just some more war griffins. I'm pretty sure we fought those guys before. If not, all they really did was just fly at us. But yes, yeah, finally nice that seeing um, Angelo stealing MP from enemies. <laughs> he already had full MP from the rest of the end, obviously, but I'm so excited to have that ability now. Oh, you have no idea. Uh, actually, there's like a gateway over there, I guess. Um, should I be riding? Okay, well, let's not, let's not get our tiger out. Oh yeah, the tiger can even come out here, remember? I remember that from the last time. But anyway, let's try opening this chest. Whoa, wait a minute. A helicator? I haven't even seen this, seen this enemy type before. Okay, why don't we, uh... We have no idea how strong it is. Yeah, let's just try calling our team, first of all. Okay, let's see what we have here. Yoshi calls. Oh yeah, I changed out uh, Podbelly, and I remember now. Sorry, I am kind of slow today, aren't I? Okay, Ooh, that's not too bad. Uh, laser's kind of useless. When it's just one enemy. Well, I guess it's not useless, just not as strong as. Yeah, there we go, an arrow. Oh, this helicator is pretty slow. Kind of powerful, I guess. Only because it attack once too. Hmm. Nice. Looks like Hackzilla doesn't seem to mind his new party members too much. <laughs> I don't know, it just seems like Potbelly was on our team for so long, I just feel feel kind of sad for leaving him behind now, but... Oh well, it's not that big of a deal, I guess. A mighty armlet. I think we already have one of those, but let's check. Ah, oh, okay, sturdy fur garment, capable of reducing damage. Oh, wait a minute, that's a fur poncho, you, you dork. What was I... Oh, we must already have it, because, yeah. Oh, okay. Well, let's just... Uh, I don't remember, so... Oh, it increases our attack by quite a bit. That might be good for... Oh, now nah, let's, nah, let's, let's leave it alone. I'd rather have more defense than more attack. At least at the moment. Maybe... I don't know. Well, our defense isn't too bad right now. I mean, it'd be a bad idea getting some more attack, but... Oh, yep, there's the shadow, all right. Uh, hopefully this isn't a point-in-return type thing if we get sent to the netherworld and we can't come back. Uh, do we chase it? Maybe we go try going through the gateway? Um, oh no! Oh, we need to chase it! Okay, I see. Come back here, yes! Oh, that's probably why we couldn't get the tiger out here. Yeah, these fights aren't too bad right now, but I'm just glad we're getting some more money after I spent all that. All that stuff on Angel's equipment. But anyway, what I was trying to say is, this is probably why they didn't want the Saber Cat here, is because they didn't want us being able to travel too fast for the shadow, and oh shoot, where to go? Okay, there's. I got 
took me a second to figure out what the game actually wanted from me, but hey, it looks like we're supposed to chase it around here. It looks like we're starting to catch up. Uh, shoot, where is this leading us? Tell us your mysteries, oh mystic shadow! Oh, shoot. Oh, and a new enemy. A Mojo Macho. <laughs> I get it, because it's the reverse of what we saw earlier. Um, we need a heal too, actually. Start things off with a zap. Yangus, just in case, you should use a helm splitter. Angelo, you should maybe try attacking it. Oh, no, 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 whoops, what am I doing? Multi heal, just in case. And Jessica, this time, why don't you. Yeah. I really don't know if I'll be using the whip too much longer, guys. I mean, I know it's powerful, but. I like Jessica's magic just as much, really. And that's where most of her skill points are, anyways. And, well, not skill points, but her, like, regular stats. She has, like, so much wisdom. Why would I not use magic with her? But, yeah. Uh, we'll see. Uh, let's see. This guy doesn't seem too bad. Yeah. Okay. Okay, let's just finish these guys off real quick, then. They weren't too much of a threat. They are fast, oh jeez. At least the war griffins, I guess. Hmm. Oh, they're in, they were in different groups, okay, so I couldn't multi-target them. Oh, that's a shame. <laughs> Excuse me. I just now realized that. <laughs> okay, Falcon Slash, and then let's end this fight off. We need to get back to chasing that shadow. Which I'm assuming is the right thing to do. Ah, I'm beginning to see why, um... Um... Uh, that MP stealing thing probably wasn't implemented in this game. It's because only so, only some enemies have MP. If an enemy doesn't have like any, any MP moves that cost any MP, I don't think the programmers gave them any, gave them any to begin with. So maybe that's why it, maybe the whole MP stealing thing isn't a much big of a deal as I thought. But I'm still glad I have it. I just need to keep in mind which enemies actually have MP to steal in the first place, I guess. Sorry, I hope I didn't, um... hope I didn't, like, say that too fast. I know it's had a lot recently. Uh... Ah, darn it. Anyway, what I was trying to say is what I noticed... Oh, jeez, look at this. Oh, shoot, where's the sh Okay, there it is. I noticed earlier is that, uh... Do we follow into the poison bog? I think we need to. Uh, keep in mind, there's a treasure chest here. Okay, uh, anyway, um... What was I even? Oh yeah, whenever I start a new recording session, I realize that I start talking really fast. I don't know if it's because I'm just, like, full of energy, or if it's just, like, this really bad tick I've gone into. Yeah, so I'm not sure what I need to do to change... I don't know, I just need to keep in mind not to talk so fast, I guess. Okay, we caught up to the shadow. Hmm. I guess this was supposed to happen because it starts circling upon itself. Oh, sorry, I thought there was someone on my door. Uh. Oh. Yeah, that looks safe. <laughs> Let's just jump in head first, huh, guys? <laughs> um. I don't think this will go away. Actually, I need to go get that chest in that poison bog, so... Um, I'll be right back. You have got to be kidding me. You have got... Wait, wait, let me check. Oh my god! I spent 9,000 coins on it, and I found it five minutes later. Oh, you guys are probably yelling at me in the comments. Oh, God. Oh, God damn it! Oh, well, I'll sell that to the merchants later. Jeez. Okay, okay, fine. Um, off back to that, uh, evil portal or whatever it was. God, I need to heal up again. <laughs> uh. Oh, wait, that's a new enemy. Uh, okay, I don't know. And why are there? Why are we finding slimes? 
Level 1 slimes. Um, okay. Jeez. Uh... It's, I don't know. Just for fun, kaboom. I'm not sure, yeah. What do we even... Yeah, these... Okay. <laughs> Using a level 3 spell on level 1 enemies. Jeez, 119 damage. Those poor guys didn't stand a chance. Uh, okay. Wow. Okay. Let's see what we have here, huh, guys? Uh, mm, sorry, I need a stretch. Well, what's all this? Okay. Just Ishimari standing on the other side. Oh, you seem to have found another one of my portals. No, this doesn't seem to be the case. I don't know what our party members have to say about all this. It's not only so much a lord of realm of darkness as a realm of monochrome, I guess, but it's going to be a real thing. Yeah, no, that's what I was thinking too, Yangus. I mean, it ain't so different from our world, really, is it? You just have to get used to the lack of color. <laughs> Try only policy. You're so observant as you are thick. Apart from the colors. Yeah, that's weird. Strong correlation, right? Can't figure out what you're on. <laughs> I kind of wish I would talk to my party members more often because yeah, this is actually some pretty good dialogue. We've come to all the way here. Might as well look around. According to the chief, I mean, Pichu must be somewhere around here. We actually came to another world. Now this is a story from the pub. Yeah, true enough. No, no one would believe you. Uh, after Impera, no, it's not. As... Hmm. Well, sitting in the cock and... Oh yeah, that was the bar we met him in. Okay, I never would imagine sort of stuff existed. Huh. Well, it's kind of... Yeah, it's... And yes, this is Dark Ruins music again, too, but... Hmm. Are these enemies stronger? Oh, it's the shadows from when we fought Jessica. Odd. And magic didn't work at all against them, did it? Well, okay, let's have everyone else use physical, but let's let Jessica do her magic thing. And just see if it works out against the skeletons, or the shadows for that matter. Ooh, that's bright. Damn. Um, actually, it, well, it did a lot better than to the skeletons. It did to the... Uh, shadow, excuse me. Hmm. Yeah, it's still pretty resilient, that's for sure. Huh. Let's see, I'm gonna display a lot. Oh, well, not too bad, actually. I mean, granted, it's six enemies, so it adds up, but still, yeah. And I kinda like in this magic bikini, besides its obvious looks, it's, and it's really good resistance-wise. I'm really happy, but, uh, yeah. Okay, uh, let's just, well, no. Let's, uh, zap these guys and call it a day, hopefully. Actually... Let's, uh... Let's try taking these guys out as fast as possible. Oh, darn it, another sound glitch? Oh, I'm sorry, guys. Bloody hell. I swear, I'll buy some new cables sooner later than later. If it takes me to end the playthrough, or even my next Let's Play. I crumba. Jessica still seems pretty weak against breath attacks, so I was asking. Uh, hopefully we can take this guy out before there's any more problems, so... Not oh, darn it. Okay. Oh, dang. I remember... Did, were these guys able to dodge that well? I honestly can't remember. Oh, well. Hmm. Well, the experience is a bit better. Then again, we just fought six enemies there, so I would expect as much. And I highly doubt we'll be able to call the Saber Cat here. Try. I mean, does our map even work here? Well, this is using the same world map, so I guess that's convenient. Um, I think we should try heading back to the town. I have no idea. Or maybe we're supposed to head to a cave or something. Who knows? Jeez. 
Um, a dark magma core? Huh. Okay, let's show this fight too, I guess. I'm more worried about this guy than I am the shadow, though, so... Hmm. That's what I thought. Uh, Frizzle, I guess. Ah, uh, hmm. No, this guy doesn't have any MP either. And how many enemies in this game don't have any MP? This is a little frightening. Oh well. Uh, let's see. Yeah, it's, yeah, it's holding up pretty well. Oh, no, yeah. These, yeah, these enemies aren't too bad at all. How oh, very odd. You would think these other enemies would be, like, incredibly powerful, but not so much, really. Those breath attacks still do a ton of damage, though. I'm not sure why. I don't understand. I still understand um, how magic and breath attacks are calculated as opposed to just you know straight physical attacks. Because I looked through the manual like three or four times and never said anything about it really. They don't give much much out much gold now, do they? Though. Okay. You'll all. Excuse me. So, let's see what else we got here. This is just a depressing world. I mean, a life without color? Ugh. Um, oh well, well, I guess these are these two. Kind of, I guess. Um, hmm. It's a shame. He doesn't really have any um, attack all enemies' abilities, so... I guess we'll just attack you. And neither does... Well, Angelo has, like, a swoosh and stuff. I was hoping for something that, like, attacked all enemies on the field, but... Oh, well. Uh, Jessica, I guess you can just use Kaboom. Things work fairly well. Hmm, yeah, everyone's still standing after that, so... Frizzle. Jeez. Oh. Well, I guess their wisdom isn't too good. Oh. Hmm. Interesting. <laughs> yeah, I wish I could say more guys, but these are just like recoloring the enemies, just a little stronger and, uh, you know, just monochrome. <laughs> this is like literally like the definition of boring, so there's not a whole lot I can say about it. Um, yeah, I'm not. The game. Uh, yeah, and there's nothing at the gate. So my other option is either to go to all these caves over there, or to just head back to the village, which may not be a bad thing. Uh, just on the side of this rock, okay. Hmm. Excuse me. Cricking my neck. Okay, just some more dark signs. Hmm. Yeah, so... Okay, there's... I don't see any, like, new chests. Or if they are, they're blowing into the background. Oh, uh, Dark Sea Divas. Um, okay. Still using Zap. I don't see a reason why not to use it. Um... There we go, and... Yeah, we can use Kaboom. I've been liking it so far. Uses a lot of MP, but we'll probably get into a point where we can rest soon enough. Worst case scenario, we just use some magic water too, I guess. Spells, geez. Oh, well, it's only it's only temporary, I guess. And they didn't have any MP either. Jeez, you think they would? Or maybe, or maybe his staff just only works sometimes. Eh, well, I guess sometimes it's better than nothing. Okay, there we go. Yep, not too bad. Hmm, thousand experience, though. That's not too bad. Considering how easy the fight was, it wasn't bad, I guess, is what I'm trying to say. Well, looks like that. You see, for yeah, the fire is not monochrome, though. That's kind of odd. So, ah, oh, jeez, another random counter. Okay, guys, just be careful of those uh, train enemies, the dark markabores. Is that what their name was? Anyway, was that the birds? While well, we get in the friendly music. Yeah, the... Na, 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 na
hat hat nie nie so gesucht hat. Max hat kein Bild an der Nacke am Nanok. Is this a new language? Or is it speaking backwards or something? Anyway, what I was trying to say is those tree enemies can cast Kathwak or, you know, the instant death spell that can kill your entire party, so be careful. No, they said Imperia correctly. Well, you're kind of human-ish, you just don't have color. Exocut, Excellent Imperia Kulaxi. Oh. Imperia's the only one who look, can look so colorful. Okay. Kikonikat Kiken, Maxu Daka, Hetan Kigek Nix Hunter. Oh my, Chao Yong Kun. Oh, well, not dangerous okay. to you, okay? It's spiffing. Hey, how come that wasn't translated? Spiffing. Does that mean quickly? Spiffing. That sounds familiar, though. Whoa. These are like. Oh no, these are the same. It, Models as the ones we've seen in Imperchu. Ah, so this is what all the fuss was about. Slight Italian accent, I think, but it's kind of. So now they can talk in English? Huh. You have not How did you learn English? You must have come through the dark eye. You are dwellers mm -hmm. from the world of light, no? Uh, yes, we are actually. Just as I thought. <laughs> Excuse me. Then it must be the will of the goddess that brings you to us. Either th that, or we were just falling or haphazardly, and we was brought here well, by accident. There but there is hmm. something I wish to discuss with you. Perhaps you would visit me in my home later. Ah, uh, of course, in RPG if we need to go visit just the village elder. Promise me that. You can take your time and look around the village as much as you like. Well, I was gonna do that anyway, but thank you for your permission anyway, Chief. I will be waiting then. My home is the largest dwelling here, so you'll know where to find me. That's an Italian accent now that I think about it. That almost sounds... maybe Mexican? Kind of? I don't know. Flock of Empichu. Let us hmm. go back to our work and carry on as well, at least they're not enemies. Do not forget to be kind to strangers. Oh. And honestly, I was half expecting this place to be filled with monsters. So I was like, well, maybe I should like head back and rest before coming back to this place, but nope, looks like I looked out. Um, actually, I think that'll probably do it for this episode, guys. The next, the next exciting episode of Dragon Quest VIII will, uh, um, excuse me, frog my throat. Mm, excuse me. <clears throat> Darn it, I'm sorry. <laughs> Super sickness. Anyway, in the next exciting episode of Dragon Quest VIII, we'll explore Dark Impetru or Colorless Impetru. I'm sure it has some sort of name. Anyway, thank you so much for watching, guys, and have a... Thank you so much... Don't talk so fast. Thank you so much for watching, and have a great day. Peace out.